Idaho Falls Pediatrics. Why are you supporting kids in our community in Seven Questions with Emmy? Hey guys, okay. welcome back to Seven Questions with Emmy. Today I have a special guest joining me, and I dressed in my fancy clothes too. Welcome, Vanna White. She has been keeping letters on Wheel of Fortune for nearly 40 years, has been named the world's most frequent clapper, and is the mother of two children. Vanna, it's so nice to see you today. It's so nice to see you too. You look great and you're so professional. Thank you. You're so professional too. <laughs> so you want to ask me some questions? Yes. Let's get okay. started with them. Question number one. What's the best part of your job on Wheel of Fortune? The best part of my job is making people happy and giving away money. Yeah. Question number two, how do you know where all the letters are and have you ever accidentally flipped the, over the wrong one? Very good question. I do know what the puzzles are beforehand, so I kind of know where they are. And one time I turned a wrong letter. It was either a D or an M. It was either Dr. Spock or Mr. Spock. I can't remember which it was, but I turned the wrong one. So I was mortified and it only happened that one time, thank goodness. Question number three, who chooses your pretty outfits? And I heard that you've never worn the same thing twice on your show. Is that oh, true? Well, not quite, but most of the time, I, I, one, one or two times we accidentally wore uh, the same, it wasn't the exact same dress, but it was the same style and color. So it has happened a couple of times, but I've worn over 7,000 dresses, more like 7,500 dresses. So mm -hmm. most of them one time. And also I have a stylist that they send the clothes, the designer send the clothes to the studio. I wear them and then they take them back because they're sample sizes. So I don't get to keep them, unfortunately, but the shoes are mine and the earrings are mine. Do you ever get to keep a dress though? Sometimes I will ask them if I could borrow a dress, like if there's a some kind of a charity function or something. Like so a fancy party. Yeah. So they'll let me borrow them sometimes to go to some charity event, which is nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Question number four. Have you ever been to Idaho and tried our famous potatoes? And what's your favorite kind of potato to eat? I have been to Idaho and potatoes are my favorite thing to eat. And I'm not saying that just because I'm talking to you. I love mashed potatoes. That's Idaho mine mashed too. Potatoes. Yes, I love it. I love it. It's my favorite food of all. Next time you come to Idaho, we'll meet up and get some mashed potatoes together. That would be great. What do you like to do when you're not working on Wheel of Fortune? When I'm not working on wheel, I'm a big crocheter. I like to crochet and make baby blankets and big blankets for people as gifts. So I do that for my friends and family members and that kind of a thing. So that's probably the what I love best as far as a hobby. And I, I love to travel also when I'm not working. Can you share the most embarrassing moment you'd have on TV? Oh, yes, I can. There's, there's actually a couple. I, I'll tell you two. One is many years ago, we would break for a very large lunch break. And we had mashed potatoes and roast beef and pie and all this great stuff. And I ate so much. I was so full. And when I went to put on my outfit, it was so tight. The belt popped off in the middle of a round, but I just kept on going. But that was quite embarrassing. So fortunately, my outfit didn't fall off, though. So that was good. And the second time was a couple of years ago at Christmas, at the end of the puzzle board, they have they had like presents wrapped and one of the presents got caught in the hem of my long dress. So I was dragging this present back and forth and I didn't even realize it. And Pat Sajak was just cracking up. And when I found out about it, I was a little embarrassed. Mm -hmm. If you were not working on Wheel of Fortune, what would you do for your job? What would I do? Well, first of all, I love my job on Wheel of Fortune. It is the best and it's been 39 years and I still love my job, which is great. 
if I wasn't doing this, I would probably be doing real estate of some kind. Now it's time for some bonus questions. Are you ready, Vanna? I'm ready. Question number one. What do you like about being a mom? Oh, I love everything about being a mom. There's not one specific thing I can say. Just having, having children love you as their mom is just the greatest. At school, we have a computer game that tests our reading. They have two characters named Alex Trevik and Batana White. Did you ever think that your name would be used in a game for kids? No, but I love that. Yeah, when dad told me I was going to interview Vanna White, I'm like, but that's Batana White. Am I interviewing a bat? <laughs> we'll call her my sister. Yeah. What advice do you have for me? Follow your dreams. Don't give up. Just keep going for what are, whatever it is in your heart that you want to do. Thank you so much for talking with me today, Vanna. Thank you. You have been a joy, a delight, and I wish you such great success. You, Hey, who knows? You might be the next anchor woman somewhere. You are an incredible interviewer and Maybe have a I'll great take personality. Your real job. Maybe I'll take your Wheel of Fortune job. Oh, <laughs> maybe. Hmm. Okay. Well, if there's anybody that I would be happy to give it to, it would be you. <laughs> Tell Batana I said hi. Okay. Bye. Bye-bye. Thank you so much, Vanna. Quick follow-up. What happened on the day you turned the wrong letter? Did they have to stop? They did. They did stop and just threw out that puzzle. And like no one at home ever saw that happen, of course, right? <laughs> but, but it stuck with me for years and years and years. And it still, it still makes me crazy. And, and is it easier now that it's the, the touch rather than turning the, the number, the letters? Oh. It's, uh, you know, I said, is there any way you can make my job easier? No. <laughs> I didn't really say that, but they did make it easier when they, you know, now that I touch the letters instead of turning them. And also, since I don't turn them anymore, I'm not the one that makes the mistake. I only touch right. them. Right up, so I'll never make that mistake again. Yeah. Well, oh, you're, oh, go ahead. I said hi too. I, sh I sure will tell him you said hello. I'm going to see him shortly. I want to interview him too. You do? I know he would probably love that. So maybe that can work out another time, huh? Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful holiday and uh, we'll be watching tonight. Thank you. Thank you. Same to you guys. Take Bye. care. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Idaho Falls Pediatrics. Why are you supporting kids in our community and sharing questions with Emmy?